The next one is Sasuke, and dude, look who we've got on his fan blade right there. Ooh, the little serpents. Welcome home, Shinobi. It's your boy Marcus here, and welcome to Anime Avenue, the channel where I collect absolutely everything anime, but Naruto is my ninja way. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys aren't, you know the drill. Anime Festival Flip! <laughs> It's about to get a whole lot brighter up back because your boy is here and today I am extremely extremely excited because we are gonna be adding to my Naruto collection and usually that's always kind of biasly what I like the most most of the time right all the time 50 50 uh, 100 to 0 I don't like those odds that's true but we're gonna be opening up an awesome set of figures today that is the 10th anniversary at Chimi Omega I'm not super familiar with the brand but I know that I love these figures so much this set is absolutely gorgeous dude check out the Sasuke do you remember we actually have have two of these. Oh yeah, I do. Yeah, so we have two of them over here, and I thought they were absolutely gorgeous. They're so small, but they are around like $15 because the detail is unbelievable. But when we got that set, I automatically knew that I needed that set somewhere back here in the main line, because this whole background is a celebration of Naruto, and this is a celebratory, the fireworks and all in the background. Let's go ahead and without any further ado, let's pop this open. I'm extremely excited. I want to add it back here in the background, so hopefully we get the whole set. Let's check it out. Okay, so Mitchell's pop the whole screen on set so we can check these off as we get through them but we're gonna check them out see if we can get the whole set and also check out the details in each character let's start with our first one let's do it oh man it feels so good to open the whole box so we're at the box lunch they were few and far between i had to scrape and crawl on the floor oh man they don't tell you what stuff falls outside of that lunch box on the floor there. It's disgusting. Underneath those shelves are some things that you wouldn't even imagine, okay? There was expired box lunch money down there. There was old clothes for kids from another country. It, it was a sad sight. But let's go ahead and see we got our first one. Let's do it. All right, so checking off the list, we got, okay, so we got Sasuke six. I wanted to make sure we didn't get a dupe from one ones you already have, but we got Sasuke right here. And that is in the red costume. So there's two variations I'm noticing. There's a, a blue variation and a red variation for all of them. But I don't know the significance of it, to be honest. I feel like the first wave kind of like inspired to the character, but then the red one is just like something where they all kind of commemorate to you as a group. Yeah, that's a, that's pretty accurate. Yeah, so let's go ahead and check this one out. So this is the red one. So this, this is the costume they're all going to be sharing, but they do have designs that are independent to each one. But hey, look at their fans. Their fans are actually different. So his has the Leaf Village symbol, but check out Sasuke's. I love how he can just never live that moment down. Like, <laughs> like he's, a, he's the Shadow Hokage now, but we'll never let him forget when he left the leave village <laughs> all right so there he is absolutely adorable i don't know how well it's so small i'm hoping the camera picks up everything how is it looking over there looking good sweet and we actually have his i didn't even notice it. it actually has his sword as well which is awesome so that's our first one right there let's keep it moving all right character number two. Oh yes oh, get the red. I, I love the red costume but i think the red costume is like the one that you can kind of expect the most because half of them have the red costume but i want to well, see the other half doesn't i know but those ones are like unique to them you know i kind of like that better but we got kakashi dude he looks so how does kakashi look so dope in everything he wears because they gave him the shotting gun that matches his his robe yeah dude like his just looks so clean i thought that was pakun on the front right there but that's actually just bull so that's one of his other dogs it's the big ass one that's like biting zabu's on the shoulder oh i remember that. like that monster of one <laughs> that's actually what we got on there so that is really cool oh no but then look on his a regular one is gonna be Pakun. That is super cool. Okay. All right, so we got Kakashi right there. Let's go ahead and put him on his base. All right, so we got the, I guess like the, I feel like Kakashi definitely had some favoritism for Sasuke at the start. So I want to say the duo. <laughs> Absolutely cool. Dude, I love these. They're so detailed. Like they remind me of the Pop Mart figures almost. Yeah. Really nice. Okay, so we got that one. Let's move on to the next one. All right, next one we got here. Come on. Dude, we are going red costume purely. I'm gonna grab from the other side of the box at this point. But right here, we got okay what do you think is gonna be his headpiece you can't look oh probably karama no it's gamakichi Right. Right, maybe on the other one's Karama. <laughs> that is awesome. You're right. It could have Karama on the other one. What does his fan have on it? Oh, the Leaf Village okay, symbol. Okay, classic Leaf Village symbol. Absolutely awesome. So let's go ahead and put him on his stand as well. As a group, they just get cooler and cooler. Doesn't take up much space in the collection. And you notice that all of their eyes, or maybe at least in Naruto's case, they're all like very similar to the Uzumaki logo. Yeah, they have like these swirls. We definitely saw that in the Hinata figure last time. Yeah. Last time? Last time. Yeah, there's an there's a, there's a S at the end of that. Sometimes, you know, S's just don't work 
work out. <laughs> All right, and then we have Naruto right there in the air. He is absolutely adorable. Classic Naruto, just like having too much fun jumping. Sasuke is like, oh, I'm going to be the only guy who stands at a side because I'm sick. And then Kakashi, he's just like, yeah, I made it. All right, let's go ahead and check out the next one. I'm going to go ahead and aim for the back of the boss. I just feel like they're all red at this point. Yeah, okay. So we got the Hinata, which is actually a dupe for us, but it's okay because we need her for the set anyway. So we got the Hinata. Let's go ahead and put her on her stand so we can see her a little bit better. So there we go that we have Hinata. I think she looks so cool. Like probably one of the most detailed of all the characters. Not only that, you know, her eyes are sick too because not they're thematic to her figure, but they're also kind of incorrect, right? Because she has, she has like the milky gloss. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. They all kind of have the Uzumaki logo in their eye. It's kind of weird. Okay, so we'll keep that over here to the right, and we'll keep the reds over here and these separate ones over there. Let's do this I next we're one. Past this. No, no. Segregation is very, very active in No Dupe City. <laughs> this is honestly kind of how we do this. Everything's very segregated. Oh, man. But you should see the political debates the Demon Slayer section gets into with the Naruto section. You don't want to be there for those meetings. The next one is Sasuke. And dude, look who we've got on his fan blade right there. Ooh, the little serpent. You know what it is? I think that's Aura? I don't even remember how to pronounce it exactly, but Sasuke Snake, that's the sickest one so far. It sounds like he's just got like a little cage and he's just a snake in there. <laughs> it's not just like this huge thing that he can just kill people. How is it that everybody gets a summoning Jutsu of something sick? Like Naruto gets toads, Kakashi gets dogs. Uh, oh, okay. You don't dogs. see anybody summoning a, a rodent, like a squirrel. I don't know, the dogs are alright. The dogs are! Dude, ninja dogs. They are very utilical. They're not like sick. Okay, so a giant frog. Oh, that's sick. It's sick. The snake, sick. But the dogs, they can use their senses. That's what I'm saying. Smell. They're very you utilical. You can disperse them eight different ways. Yeah, that's sick in, in, in... Utility is sick. Yeah, that's what, that is sick. But they themselves, it's not like a threatening thing. You know what I mean? Bro, I've literally seen you almost piss your pants at a dog barking at you before. No, I just piss my pants normally. But we got Sasuke right there. So you can see the differences here between the two. I gotta say, I love Sasuke and like the blue and like the light purplish gray he always wears. Absolutely awesome. I gotta say I prefer this one. How about yourself? You like Red Daddy or do you like Blue Lagoon? I like the Red Natty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next is the Naruto one. And so on here we got Maximum Mode. We got Gamabuta and we got Karama as the mask, which is just perfect. Oh, I love that one. Man. Yeah, that's really, really good. And this actually does have the Uzumaki logo on his robe and it's the orange as well. That one is super cool. Let's throw him on a stand. Okay, so we got the Naruto with the Naruto right here. And just a reminder also, they sent us over all of these print cards as well for both the different variations of the characters. But I think I only got two of them because I ordered two of them. We're actually be auctioning off this whole box right here, either individually or the whole box on Whatnot. Because somehow I ended up with two of them. So if you guys are interested in this whole set, go check me out on Whatnot. You get $15 off your first purchase. You might even be able to get one of these for free. So definitely go check that out. And the link will be in the description down below. I highly recommend, like I said, $15 for free. You can't beat it. And also, we're going to be giving away a DD Pop over there very soon. Wrong channel, but hey, it's a PSA grid pop for free, so go check it out. Okay, who you calling next, man? We haven't got a saga run yet, yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> so who we calling next, man? I'm call. Oh wow, I'm gonna call other Hinata. Oh, I was running out of pieces. I'm glad you figured it out. <laughs> there you go. You see how ah. terrible he treats me? <laughs> I'm a demon. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's check. You got it, dude. Sakura. Yeah, that's who I called. You, what'd you say? I don't know. I'm gonna call other oh, Nasa. I was Sakura. Mean. I said Sakura. What do you mean? I was mean to know I was doing this. The Sakura is so... Okay, I gotta be honest. I think she's the best character. Like, in this aesthetic, I think she's the best character. So I'm gonna put on her stand so you guys can see her a little better. Right there. That is gorgeous. And on there, we got Katsuyu right there, which is really cool. I just think her hair looks awesome. The whole figure is just dope. I gotta say, that's probably my favorite character so far for these particular designs. I think she transitions the best. Her and Hinata. All right, so let's keep it moving. So we almost have this whole set. Let's check it out. Let's do the next one. Oh, we're gonna get the other Sakura. Let's go ahead and pop her into the stand. We got Katsuyu right here on her flowers. But then, dude, you didn't even notice what do we got here on the actual headdress of that one. You know what that is? A Sakura flower. Sakura flower, it is. That is awesome, right? Okay, so it looks like we're missing Kakashi from one and we're missing Hinata from the other. What I will say, definitely definitely is that the pink outfit for me is better because it's all it's obviously like more you know in tune with her her hair and whatnot and not only that her her jade eyes 
pop out. Yeah, ironically though, red is what she typically wears. Yeah. yeah. All right, so let's see, we got Hinata right here. So this is the first one we're missing over here on this side. Ah oh, man, dude, like, who do you think would have gone further as an Uchiha, Neji or? Hinata. I think the Neji. Neji. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think I think Hinata has would have definite potential to go far, but she needs a lot more support and attention and time yeah. in order to reach that. And Neji is like hit by himself would go far. Yeah, yeah. And I think he's a lot colder, which would carry him further in that community. <laughs> if you want to call that a community. <laughs> so we're gonna add her. So boom, the entire red set is complete. Let's go ahead and orientate them in a way that makes a little bit more sense. Alright, so we got the sensei in the metal Kakashi along with the two couples we got Naruto Hinata the healthy relationship goals and then you've got Kakashi and then you've got probably not the best thing to look after as an example of a relationship but man they love each other and man their kid is powerful <laughs> okay friendly reminder to hit the like button if you haven't already and also of these villages on screen let me know in the comments down below which village would you want to be a part of I'm interested to see in the comments down below all right and last but not least we already know who it's gonna be and that is is Choji. <laughs> Choji deserves Dude, I know you're gonna flip out when you hear this. They're going to be getting very soon an exclusive to Hot Topic and Box Lunch. No. You don't stop, you ha. stop that. Because when I ha. do this, it's for ha. detail. And it's for ha. emphasis. But when you do it, it's called disrespect. And I'm not even gonna share this information with you now. Do you wanna hear it or what? <laughs> Yeah. Moving on. <laughs> You're not gonna hear it now. Now you lost it. Just go ahead and talk about Choji. It's not Choji, man. It's Kiba. Kiba is getting a Hot Topic box. He's the first poppy in both. <laughs> <laughs> They're doing a Kiba pop. If you guys don't know, Kiba is Parker's it's, favorite uh, character. Uh, he's the. <laughs> he said that he finds him to be the most akin to himself and that he would just love to be a part of. It's painful. The this family. Is, this is painful. He wants to be part of the Inazuka clan so bad. He wants to get that letters on his back. <laughs> you mentioned the like dogs one time. <laughs> All right, but my favorite one absolutely is this Kakashi one because this one right here, he actually has his Make Out Paradise copy and he's got Pakuun right there on the top as well. This is set variant A and then we've got set variant B completed as well. Absolutely awesome. Didn't know for sure if you already get the full set in the box, but that is beautiful. Let's go ahead and connect them. And now we can go ahead and add these on the shelf. So stick around for that. But that is actually it for this one. Again, the box is empty. Let's go ahead and check out the art cards, which are really cool because you got one for basically every character. You've got their costume costumes along with their celebratory costumes as well. So awesome little art cards right here. I don't know what I'll be doing with these for sure, but if you guys are wanting to get a chance to win a complete box or maybe in them individually, I'm not sure yet, go check it out on Whatnot, but you guys know the drill. Scan it. All right, I already told you guys where I was gonna add these in the collection. I'd already been thinking about it. And that's this right here. I wanted to add them right here on top of book set two, just cause I think it looks really, really cool. Like I said, this whole is a center shelf. It's a celebratory of the Leaf Village. So I had to have them all in their attire. Absolutely beautiful. And I had so much fun collecting them all with you guys. All right guys, so that is actually it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure you smack that like button. Do not leave this video rep pack without hitting the like button. I will greatly, greatly appreciate it. And also check out this video on your screen right here which is the last epic video on this channel i know you guys are gonna love it we did a freaking five below haul that was insane how much stuff they had for a great deal the anime theme i'll see you guys over there and as always rep pack i will see you beautiful people in the next one adios Bloop.